The rocker arms are, what they do is they float on a pivot shaft right here, which is right here and right here. Now this one is start, starting to come out. It will come all the way out. There is no pressure on the valves here with the rocker arm because right inside here is a little tiny stainless steel button and those come in different widths that will determine your um, your valve rocker arm clearance and the clearance is due to heat when things get hot they expand and your rocker arm has to have so much clearance between here and we'll we'll work on that but in order to get these out these rocker arms so I can get the valve tool on we'll pull on this just a little bit and see if that'll come out and you can see it's starting to come out right here let's see if we can get it to come out with some more Oops. yeah see that's coming out more and then you want to remember how this all goes together if you don't have a manual or you want to take your video camera and do it now I know this is going slow but if you're a, a ruckus owner and sometime in the future you need to do this you're going to want a detailed explanation on how it's done so we're going to pull this rod out right here and we can take a look at it and it's worn a little bit and we'll put that right there and then we'll come over here and we'll grab the spring and the rocker arm and we'll pull it out there's the rocker arm and here's the spring right down here and we'll put that right there. Now I know that this bottom one goes to this one and the top one's a little bit different to get out. You need, if you spin the, the um, shaft, it has a little hole right there. And what you do is you take something and put it in here like, like that and you push on it. Well, let's see if I can get that to work better. I should go out and get, get a, some of my tools when I'm too lazy. Anyway, I'm going to pull this this pull this pull out and take this off, and I'll do it. Um, I'll need two hands. 